Hey everyone, it's me, Man I'm Gaming, back with a new Undertale video. In this episode, we're gonna be going to see Dr. Alphys. It's peaceful music. Drone entrance. What's down here? There's a very long hallway. There are some stairs. It's a coffin. There's a name engraved on it. Kara. It's empty. What about the other coffins? Ah! Wait, the blue soul is missing. Well, the dark blue soul. So yeah, we need to go see Dr. Alphys. Ring. Hey! Uh, this is Undyne. Wait. Wait. Shut up, Papyrus! This was your idea! Human! You have to deliver something for me! Uh, please? I'm at Snowden in front of Papyrus's. See ya! Okay, cool. Mm. Wait a sec. No, 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 it was over here. Hey, go up to a creepy alleyway to, to the right for some great deals. Okay? Mm, probably to someone's house law. You should buy all our stuff. Buy it for 600G. Yeah. You have too many items. Alright. Exit. Later. Hold on. Item. Actually, hold on. Sell. Dimension box A. Ah, why did I do that? Sell. A. Press X to finish. We have the junk food. Uh, weapon. We have the empty gun. Plus two attack. Defense up. Attack up when worn. And then mystery key. Probably to someone's house, lol. Buy it for 600 G. Sold out. Braddy, we're gonna be rich. <laughs> okay. Yeah, check it out. Let's talk. About you two. I'm Braddy, and this is my best friend, Caddy. I'm Caddy, and this is my best friend, Braddy. Yeah, yeah. Cool. I vouch your wares. The stuff inside is, like, totally wicked expensive. But, like, this stuff we found is, like, totally wicked cheap. You should, like, totally wicked buy all of it. Origin of wares. I mean, like, where does anyone get guns or food or... We found it in the garbage. It's good garbage. It's, like, really good garbage. Origin of garbage. Where do we get the garbage? Like, the garbage store, the Waterfall, mostly. I found a gun in a dumpster. About Metaton. Oh my god, Metaton! He's, like, my robot husband. Actually, he's, like, my robot husband. I think we're, like, are both going to marry him. We're both, like, already married to him. He just, like, doesn't know it yet. So, like, Dr. Alphys built Metaton, right? That's, like, what they tell you. But, like, Metaton always acts like being built was his idea somehow. And even after he was built, he acted like Alphys was an old friend. But they're, like, not friends anymore. Yeah, unlike me and Braddy, best friends forever. About Metaton, old. Oh my god, Metaton. Alright, yeah, whatever. About Alphys. Oh my god, Alphys. She used to live on our street. She was, like, a big sister. I mean, like, if your big sister takes you to on trips to the dump. She showed us the coolest places to find trash. She was always collecting these weird cartoons. Then she became the royal scientist. Yeah, we haven't seen her in forever. Royal scientist. So Alphys is always, like, thought Asgore is a super cutie. So, like, I'm pretty sure she made Metaton to, like, totally impress him. What about Undyne? A robot with a soul. That's, like, super relevant to his hobbies. After seeing Metaton, Asgore asked her to do all this science stuff for him. But nobody's, like, seen anything from her yet. Or her at all. She must, like, just be stay in her lab all day. Like, live a little, girl. Yeah, like us. About Asgore. Oh my god, he's a total goober. He's a big fuzzy goofball. Like, I love that guy. He's, like, so nice. 
God, we're like so hyped for the destruction of humanity. Okay, cool. I need to leave now. Like, see you later, like later and stuff. Cool. Now I have a key. There is still so much stuff that I want to do and want to show you. Tra la la, if it's hot or cold, you can count on me. Thank you. Who is the river person? We need to know! Tell us, Toby! Come again sometime, tra la la. What's going on? What's up with all these houses? You like to wander. You must be young. Can we please play something else? You like to wander. You must be young. Can we please play something else? What does this say? Let's continue to play monsters and humans. Okay, please play something else. Monsters and humans. No, oh, I can knock. Ah, what a beautiful knock. Maybe if I don't answer, I'll hear it again. Ah, my patience rewards me. Why? What is going on? Um, hello, Mr. Dog. Why are you throwing cubes? Of ice? This, this, I don't understand this. What, what is going on here? My mind is going to explode. Anyway, um, oh yeah, I want to talk to you. Maybe I'll try frowning for once. No, I just can't do it. Wait, I've got a joke. Knock, knock. Uh, that's all I've thought of. Yeah, cool. What if I ran for mayor? I don't think I would do a good job. I hate responsibility. But I love politics. That might be a perfect match. Uh, no. No, why am I over here? I don't even know what I was doing over here. I need to go. All the way over there. Yay! Papyrus! It seems Undyne has something for you. She's the person that's not me. Hey, I have something to give you. But you're carrying way too much. Oh yeah, good point. I, uh... Oh wait! Hold on. Dog Shrine. Donate. Dognate. You put one G into the box. You feel like you're about to waste a lot of time. One of two G in the box? Keep putting the money! Oh, the box is full. If I go back in... It seems like your money was used to buy fair lights. It's kind of dark in here. Zero of four G? You donated one G. What? One of four G? You donated one G, okay? Two of four G? What is this? I don't understand. Clink, the box is filled. Perhaps if you leave and return, the donations will be used for something. Dumplings, they look slightly nibbled. Looks like the dog didn't like them very much. So far, the donation money has been totally wasted. Yeah, I'm not gonna keep doing this. I need to find a place to uh, get rid of these items that I have. Let's get, oh, hold on. Let's get rid of two cinnamon bunnies. Besides that a friendly town fills you with determination. Determination! Oh wait, I need to go up here. Um, so I have a favor to ask. I need you to deliver this letter to Dr. Alphys. Huh? Why don't I do it myself? Um, well, it's kind of personal, but we're friends, so I'll tell you. Hotland sucks! I don't want to have to go over here. So here you go. You got the Undyne's letter. Oh, and if you read it, I'll kill you. Thanks so much. You're the best. <laughs> oh my god. I'm gonna freaking kill you. So, what are you waiting for? The sooner you get over with, the better. Oh, yeah, good point. Undyne writes a lot of letters, but she can never seem to find the right words, and when she goes to deliver them herself, she always quits so she can go back to rewrite. That's why she asked you, because you have no standards. Uh, hello? I have very high standards, Papyrus. I can make spaghetti. No, wait, that's your standards. Try a lot, care for a ride, yeah, ride. Um, oh my god, no, I messed up. I clicked waterfall instead of hotland. This guy can ask you. Come again sometime, tra la la.
I like this area. You feel a calming tranquility. You feel determ determination. The quiet area. I like it. Oh, I naps the book. Uh, I'm gonna keep working on that mix CD. I never figured out who's it. It's locked. Use the mystery key. The red house door was unlocked. The key disappeared. What is going on? Dear diary, Shiren's sister fell down recently. It's sad. Without her sister to speak for her, she's become more reclusive than ever. So I reached out to her and told her that she, Bluki, and I should all perform together. He seemed to like that idea. I don't know which. Dear diary, I like to buy dearer diary. I like to buy a new diary for every entry I make. I love to collect diaries. Dearest diary, our cousin left the farm to become a training dummy. Dummy, that leaves just Bluki and I. Bluki asked me if I was going to try to become corporeal too. They sounded so resigned. Come on, Bluki, you know I never leave you behind. And besides, I'd never find the body I'm, the kind of body I'm looking for anyway. My darling diary, I met someone. Interesting today. Last week I posted that advertisement for my human fan club. Today was our first meeting. Only one other person came. Honestly, she's a dork and she's obsessed with these awful cartoons, but she's kind of funny too. I want to see her again. Diary, my dear. My diary collection is going fabulously. I have like five now. Dear diary, she surprised me with something today. Sketches of a body that she wants to create for me. A form beyond my wildest fantasies. In a form like that, I could finally feel like myself. After all, there's no way I can be a star the way I am now. Sorry, Bluki. My dreams can't wait for anyone. Wow. Is that Metaton? North, wherever, Temi Village. All right. Mm -hmm. Oh, wait, now I can pick up that. Use the box, yes. Get the other cinnamon bunny. Try to lock here for a ride, yes. Where will we go? Hotland. Then we're off. Try to lock, what's inside an acorn? It's really just a mystery, yeah. Come again sometime. Try to lock. I like the rare person. Seeing such a strange laboratory, you're filled with determination. Hotland, lab entrance. The door has no mail slot. Slide the letter under, slide. You slide the letter under the door and give it a knock. Oh, is that another letter? I don't want to open it. Can't I just slide it back out? No, I can't keep doing this. I'll read this one. Um, it's, it's shut kind of strongly, isn't it? Wait a second. Hey, if this is a joke, it's... Oh my god. Did you write this letter? It wasn't signed, so I have no idea who could have... Oh my god, oh no, that's adorable. And I had no idea you um, wrote that way. It's surprising, too, after all the gross stuff I did. I don't really deserve to be forgiven. Much less, um, this. And so passionately... What? What was in the letter? You know what? Okay, I'll do it. It's the least I can... Yeah, let's go on a date. Wait, what now? Dating start. Oh my gosh, I love these dating scenes. Dating start? Question mark? Uh, sorry, I'm still getting dressed. How do I look? My friend helped me pick out this dress. She's got a great sense of... Um, anyway, let's do this. Dating start. Hey, wait. Actually, we still can't start the date yet. Dating stop? <laughs> um, I've got to give you items to render your affection. That'll increase the chance of a successful outcome to the date, right? Anyway, don't worry, I'm prepared. I've been stockpiling gifts in anticipation for a date like this. First, I've got some metal armor polish. <laughs> uh, maybe you can't use that. But, I also brought some waterproof cream for your skin. Oh. Your, uh, scales. Uh, well, how about this magical spear repair kit that I... Just, just admit it, Alphys, come on. Um, hey, let's forget about the items. Let's just start the date. 
The dating start. Finally! Yeah, uh, let's, uh, date. What's going on, then? She's smiling. Now she's gonna go, like, what? Now she's sweating. Uh, do you like anime? Uh, depends. Hey, me too. Hey, let's go somewhere. But where's a good place to go on a date? I've got it. Let's go to the garbage dump. Here we are. This is where Undyne and I come all the time. We find all sorts of great stuff here. Yeah, she's really, uh... She's sweating. Oh no. That's her over there. I can't let her see me on a... Why? Because, oh well, you like her. That's why. Hey, there you are. I uh, realized that you deliver that thing. It might be a bad idea. So I'm gonna do it. Give it to me. Huh? You don't have it? Ah! Have you at least seen her? Yeah, I've seen her. Yes. So she's around here somewhere. Thanks. I'll keep looking. Oh my god. Well, well I guess it's obvious, huh? I, uh, I really like her. I mean, more than I like other people. I'm sorry, I just figured, you know, it'd be fun to, like, go on a pretend date, I don't know. Well, it's worse. I'm sorry I messed up again. Undyne's the person I really want to go on a date with, but she's way out of my league. Not that you aren't cool, but uh, Undyne, she's so confident and strong and funny. I'm just a nobody, a fraud. I'm the real scientist, but all I've ever done is hurt people. I've told her so many lies, she thinks I'm a lot cooler than I actually am. If she gets close to me, she'll find out the truth about me. What should I do? Tell her the truth. The truth, but if I tell her that, she'll hate me. Isn't it better this way? To live a lie where both people are happy? Or a truth where neither of us are. They say be yourself, but I don't really like who myself is. I would rather just be whatever makes people like me. <laughs> no, you're right. Every day I'm scared. Scared what will happen if people learn the truth on their own. They'll all get hurt because of me, but how can I tell undying the truth? I don't have the confidence. I'm going to mess it up. How can I practice? Let's roleplay it. Roleplay? Um... That sounds kind of fun. Okay, wh which one would I be Undyne? I'll be Undyne. Oh, right. Obviously. <laughs> um, hi, Undyne. How are you doing today? I'm fine. Ha, ha. Glad to hear that. Uh, so I'd like to talk to you about something. <laughs> what is it? Then she gets to you. What? Undyne would never. Uh, hold on. I looked gently into her eyes. <laughs> what is going on? Is she okay? What did you just say? Uh, Undyne, I was just... Hey, whoa, wait a second. Your outfit's really cute. Let's get Kazen. Wait a second. Are you two on a date? Uh, yes. I mean, I know we are, but I mean, actually, we're on... What? I mean, I mean, I mean... Tell her! I've been lying to you. What? About what? About, well, everything. I told you that seaweed was, like, scientifically important. Really, I just used it to make ice cream. On those human history books, they're just dorky comic books. And those, in the history movies, those those are just uh, anime. They aren't real. And that time I told you I was busy with work on the phone, I was just eating frozen yogurt in my pajamas. That's why my outfits. I, I just wanted to impress you. I just wanted you to think I was smart and cool. That I wasn't some nerdy loser. Alphys. Undyne. I, I really think you're neat. Okay, Alphys. This is what a date is! Alphys! I, I think you're neat too, I guess. But you've got to realize, most of what you said doesn't really matter to me. I don't care if you're watching kid cartoons or reading history books. To me, all that stuff is just nerdy. What I like about you is that you're passionate. You're analytical. It doesn't matter what it is, you care about it. 100% at maximum power. So you don't have to lie to me. I don't want to have to live a lie anymore. Alphys, I want to help you become happy with who you are. And I know just the training you need to do that. Undyne, you. You're going to train me? <laughs> what? Me? Oh my gosh, yes. Yes. Nah, I'm going to get Papyrus to do it. Get those bones a-shaking. It's time to jog 100 laps. 
hooting about how great we are. Ready? I'm about to start the timer. Undyne, I'll do my best. Whoa, 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 wait. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Look above Undyne. Look above Undyne. Look at What the heck is the dog doing there? Oh my god! She was kidding, right? Those cartoons, those comics, those are so real, right? Anime is real, right? <laughs> what should I tell her? <laughs> Technically, anime is real. Anime is a real genre, so yes, anime is real. Ha ha ha! I knew it! Gigantic swords, magical princesses, here I come! Uh, thank you for taking care of office. I didn't want to, I didn't get to say what I wanted to, but things seem like they're going to get better for her. Well, I gotta catch up with them later. Cool. Piles of garbage. There are quite a few brands you recognize. Partaking in worthless garbage fills you with determination. You rest your you rest your hand on the rusted bike. Its horn wheezes a honk of despair. It's a DVD case for an anime. Desperate claw marks cover the edges. Ring. Howdy. If it isn't my good friend who trusts me, this is Papyrus. You're also mutual friend. Alphys and I finished our training early, very early, so I sent her home. Very home. Uh, now, I feel strongly and for no apparent reason. You should also go there to her lab house. I have only good feelings about this goodbye. Papyrus, what's going on? Come on, I have to do it. I have to. I mean, I can't, I can't end the episode off like this. I was like, where are we going? I clicked Snowden. I guess we're going to Snowden to see Papyrus and Undyne. Very quickly before we go and see Elphys. Troll aloud, what's my name? It doesn't really matter. Yes, I want to know. Stranger danger. No. Come again sometime, Troll la. Hey, you're leaving soon, right? Don't come here to say goodbye. Goodbyes aren't allowed in my town. Just see you later. Hey, punk, what's up? A two, Papyrus. How can you stand this cold? I have no skin. So why don't we, why don't we stand in grillbies instead? Because I hate grease. But you don't have a stomach. No, but I have standards. Okay. I've never checked out their house. It's a mailbox overflowing with unread junk mail. It's locked. There's a, there's a secret door? Cool. <laughs> Alright, let's go and see Alphys. <sighs> Come on. And I clicked waterfall. Come again sometime, Tralala. -la. Yeah, I get it. It's filled with determination. <sighs> Whoa, this, the bathroom open. It's a note from Alphys. Read it? Do not. No, I need to read it. It's hard to read because of the handwriting, but you try your best. Hey, thanks for your help back there. You guys, your support really meant a lot to me, but as difficult as to say this, you guys alone can't magically make my problems go away. I want to be a better person. I don't want to be afraid anymore, and for that to happen, I have to be able to face my own mistakes. I'm going to start doing that right now. I want to be clear. This isn't anyone's problem but mine. But if you don't ever hear from me again, if you want to know the truth, enter the door to the north of this note. You all at least deserve to know what I did. That's all she wrote. <sighs> what is 
you do. Come on, guys. You already all know what she did in the next episode of Undertale. We'll be checking out the true lab.